In cuts, the gene for far color is sex linked. Letter G represents the gene for ginger far color, while letter B represents the gene for black far color in a given cut species. These genes are codominant. So what does this tell us? It tells us that number one, the genes that are responsible for far color in this cut species are found on the sex chromosomes and this is what is meant by sex linked. So we have sex chromosomes, the X and Y chromosomes. These determine the sex of an individual, whether male or female. So some genes are located on the sex chromosomes and are inherited together with those that determine sex, as is the case here. Now, if you proceed to the second sentence, we are being told that we have two letters that will be used to determine the two different genes. These genes are codominant. Now, codominant is a type of inheritance whereby you're going to have two alleles that determine a particular trait and both of these alleles are dominant and as such are going to be expressed equally in the phenotype. Heterozygous females have ginger and black patches of fur and their phenotype is described as turquoise jet. So this tells us that only female cats can have both alleles, one for ginger fur color and one for black fur color. So this shows us that these genes are only present on the X chromosome. We already knew they were found on the sex chromosomes, but now we are aware that they are found on the X chromosome and not on the Y chromosome. So male cats have only one X chromosome and one Y chromosome and can therefore never be heterozygous. They will only ever possess one of these alleles. On to part B. A tortoise shell female was crossed with a black male, determining the genotypes and phenotypes of their offsprings. The parental genotypes are as such, those are the gametes, and lastly the F1 genotypes. And those, ladies and gentlemen, are the phenotypes of the offsprings.